me get this gay. Who goes to a mall and thinks, yup, this is the perfect place to force my beliefs on everybody through vocal flash mob? You don't see legitimate cooperating when people having a gay pride parade in the Chick-fil-A You are so right. Us Christians, we push ourselves way too much on you guys. I mean, we have a whole month dedicated to being Christians. Major corporations change their logos to crosses to show their support for us Christians. There's parades everywhere. Men, women, children just throwing Christianity in your face. And it's gotten so bad and so out of control that even the media and celebrities are constantly talking about Christianity and how everybody needs to be exposed to it. The saddest part about this whole thing, it just hurts my heart, is that if you don't believe in Christianity and you don't like it, we'll call you a phobe, a phobic, a Christian phobe. Hey, are you even listening to me? Wake up. There you are. You're back in reality with the rest of us. Are we just gonna sit here and pretend that you guys don't have like a whole month dedicated to being gay? Really? Really? And as far as, you know, doing a flash mob in a mall, of course you guys wouldn't do it there. You guys would rather do it here. And shoving our beliefs down your throats? Wait a minute, isn't that what your whole movement is about? Uh, whippings and all that kind of stuff, a perversion really of affection. And it's about flaunting an aggressive sexuality without any moderation or any consideration or any sense of time and place. Uh, dignity. Yeah, I'd say that's what the whole movement is about really. I mean, it's no consideration for anybody else. I mean, as you just seen, we're walking around in BDSM gear, half naked. Flaunting it, we don't care, because we should be able to do whatever we want. Because we're here and we're queer, right? That reminds me. Let me show you one of my other favorite clips. I'm sorry, who's pushing their beliefs down everybody's throats? I mean, you guys don't just stop at adults. You go for little children. You know, underage children that you want to push your progressive sexual ideologies on. Back in my day, that would have been criminal. And lastly, you guys want respect, right? You want respect from us Christian folks. Well, let me give you a tip or a pointer, if you will. If you want respect, stop doing this. So just to make sure I'm correct here, um, you demand that we respect you, yet you guys continuously disrespect us Christians and our God. You go so far as to physically blaspheme our God and make a mockery out of it and joke about it. And as a Christian, I can tell you that's extremely offensive. You are mocking my God, but you don't care. You don't care at all because you think it's all a joke. You think it's funny to disrespect other people. Let me clue you in on something. Respect is not given. It's earned. And so far, you haven't earned one ounce.